I did not always want to be a lawyer. When I was in college, I majored in social work, and my field work placement in my senior year of college was at the Detroit Recorder's Court, the criminal court in Wayne County. And it was in that setting that I got to watch lawyers firsthand, and I decided at that time that I was more interested in going to law school than I was in pursuing a master's in social work. She's piece of the agenda for October 27th, and she's fine with everything. Interestingly, the activities in which I've been engaged throughout the course of my career have been a combination of social work and law, I think, especially my interest in work involving the welfare of children. We don't have a follow up. See, here all it says is record any additional findings. I've been very proud of the work that I've done and that I've done with others in terms of assisting aging out foster youth. With the help of Governor Snyder back in 2011 and the years ensuing after that, we were able to create a voluntary foster care system for foster youth over age 18 so that they could remain in the system, receive stipends, go to college, and assist with, with their career quests in life. I think I understood my capacity for leadership at the time that I was asked to run for the Michigan Supreme Court back in 1998. At that time, I was the chief judge of the Michigan Court of Appeals. I was already in a leadership role on that court, but facing the rigors of a statewide campaign made me realize very graphically that I was responsible and that I would need to uh, give it my all if this goal were to be met of becoming a leader in Michigan's judicial branch. The facility yeah. to be open from 9 to 3.30. Okay. I still, have I still have things that I would like to see accomplished and one that is very near and dear to my heart is helping returning citizens as they leave the Wayne County Jail. So I'm ho hoping that we can help more people upon their release from the jail find social services that they need, get job training, and hopefully reduce our recidivism rate in Wayne County. So that remains a major goal of mine and I'm very proud to work with the Wayne County Jail Outreach Ministry on attempting to accomplish that goal in the coming months and years. She says I was her mentor she, when she yeah. became a judge and yes. I didn't even know that. I was stunned when I learned that I had been chosen to receive the Neil Shine Shining Light Award. As a young attorney, I was very fortunate to meet Neil Shine, and to this day he remains a hero in my mind and a hero in our community. I am very thrilled that I've spent almost 50 years practicing law. It's been a gift every day.